right now this offensive line is doing exactly what they think they needed to do, and that's establish the front and winning up front. Off of a play fake, Sullivan pointing out blockers, and Sullivan stays in bounds, slips up field, he's in for a touchdown! He faked out the Howard secondary and stayed on the move! Howard comes in here looking for one of their biggest wins in school history, facing a third down, and Williams chucks it to nobody out in the flat. And he sets the middle of that Howard defense. Devin Jackson, and Sullivan to the outside, and he's clipped down. But a very fast defense for Howard. They walked up man to the top, looks like they're playing off now. Sullivan on third down, nice that pocket closes. Sullivan is sacked. Terrence Holland from right up the gut for Howard. This is interesting. If they don't get any more yards here, do they go for it? I would. Um, maybe now I wouldn't. <laughs> now they're not going to get any yards. They'll get negative yards with Gallup in making another play with Noah Miles helping him out. So did Jevin Jackson. Williams to throw for Howard and a back shoulder shot reeled in by Hawthorne, but he was not in bounds. That's a great, great throw. Don't let him get into the defense they want. Get the ball in James' hands. Uh, Howard's sideline rapidly clapping and they don't get there. Xander Mueller in the backfield to turn it over. And in plus territory after a gain of 11 for Porter. And it opens up for Hyman into the second level. A uh, first down for Joseph Hyman. 31 seconds left after the Northwestern timeout. They've been keeping the ball on the ground, and they've been having success with their O-line. And Sullivan to the end zone for a touchdown. He bangs it in to Bryce Kurtz to extend the lead for the Cats. Deshaun Scroggins, redshirt freshman, in the biggest game of his life on the goal line, and that's... Touchdown. In for a touchdown. Touchdown. Went 17 plays in almost eight minutes and scored their first touchdown of the day. Anthony Tyus on the return for Northwestern. And along the sideline, he moves the pile across the 40-yard line. So a great catch for Cam Johnson is erased. Instead of a first down, second down behind the sticks. Sullivan pointing. Walks into the end zone! On second and long. Nothing there for James originally. Now he skirts through. James is free for a first down and looking for a cutback. And it takes every Northwestern defender to track down Eden James. It is third down for Howard. They can make it a two-score game with a touchdown and a two-point conversion, but Williams is down. Reggie Haggerty, the former FCS player. Northwestern shows pressure. Williams away and incomplete. Mueller and Pate in the backfield for the Wildcats to force the pressure and turn it over on down. And he does come back out. Offense on the field on fourth down. Sullivan with that sore thumb can't get away. Taken down by Hinton to turn it back over to Howard. Their last drive failed inside the red zone. Here's James into the second level. Eden James with a quick strike for the Bison. He outran that angle. A third down. A quick throw. It's James, has the blocking, has the first down, and he's out of bounds to he's, extend the drop. You're one-on-one -on -one down below with the safety sitting inside. And it's a play stretching out to the edge for James. He cuts outside, and James inside the five-yard line with a first down. Moving toward 200 yards on the day. Here's Hunter up the middle. That's a touchdown for the Bison. Northwestern, led by interim head coach David Braun, is halfway to bowl eligibility, six games in. And what would be an unlikely story if they can finish the job with three more wins, or maybe more, in the second half of the season.